A Columbia boy is soon coming up on his second birthday in a battle for his life. Now those who know him, along with some complete strangers, have a chance to give him a chance at more birthdays. ABC 17 Sarah Masler Donar has the story. Do you love mommy? He's not yet two years old, but Xander Barr has been a fighter his entire life. Oh, he hits like Mike Tyson back in the day. I mean, he, the kid's got a fist on him. His fight began before he was even born, when doctors diagnosed him in the womb with a rare genetic disorder called Beck with Wiedemann syndrome. We're going in and doing all this and noticed the tongue one day. And the primary deal was all the ultrasounds of his tongue. That's one of the primary markers. BWS made Xander 600 times more likely to develop childhood cancer. And then an ultrasound and surgical biopsy confirmed it. Xander had stage 3 hepatoblastoma. Now they found all these little lesions on his, on his liver and they immediately were like, well, let's just treat it with chemo, see if we can do that. Before the family could even leave the hospital, Xander was undergoing extensive chemotherapy and had to have much of his liver removed. Well, he was declared cancer free after a few months of chemo, uh, which he handled like a champ. And not two months later, it was back again, before he was even a whole year old. Xander needed a liver transplant, so his parents, Randy and Bob, began treatment at a hospital in Cincinnati, where they believed Xander would get the best care. We went out that way, did all the paperwork, got him sent out there. He had a transplanted liver in 17 days. But now that liver is failing, and Xander will need a second transplant to save his life. The United Network for Organ Sharing reports there are currently more than 122,000 people on the waiting list for a life-saving organ transplant. But there are only 10,000 registered donors. So the local community is rallying around the bars with support from all sides. I think a lot of people think of organ donations for uh, adults, but uh, this is impacting an infant and his family. So we want to increase awareness and at the same time um, have a fundraising effort to help out the Barr family. All this to make sure Xander has his fighting chance. I wouldn't have my son if it weren't for um, whoever it was that uh, gave him that first liver. I, I wouldn't have him. And that's... Uh, that's more important than really anything, so. Such a tear-jerking story, and that was ABC 17 Sarah Masler Donar reporting. Now, if you want to help or donate, you can always find a link on our website to this story, ABC 17 News.